Hello there, beautiful people. What's up? I'm back, family, with a quick word from the Lord. I don't know who this one is for, but the Lord has sent me with a quick word for someone. And what the Lord is saying is that some of you are frustrated. You've been asking the Lord about your purpose. Um, for a while now, you've been asking the Lord, what is your purpose? Um, and you've been frustrated saying that the Lord is silent. The, the Lord is silent on you. I've come here to tell you that the Lord is not silent. The Lord is speaking. It's just that you're not catching it, child of God. How do I know that the Lord is speaking? Because he speaks to his children, especially, especially along the line of purpose. God is very, very intentional. Um, when it comes to one's purpose, it is very important for, for him. It is more important for him than it is for you. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, he wants you to fulfill your purpose and he is going to do it. How do I know that God is speaking? He is not silent. Many of you are saying he's silent. He's not speaking. I'm telling you, he's speaking from my experience. I'll share with you in a bit, but he gave me Job 33. 15 and it says for God does speak now one way now another though no one perceives it in a dream in a vision of the night when deep sleep falls on people as they slumber in their beds hallelujah God is speaking to you in your dreams um, child of God you're not picking it up um, but God is saying to many of you he is working on you he's preparing you um, I've learned through my walk with God that when he is silent, it means that he is working on you. He's preparing something. Um, he is um, getting you ready spiritually for whatever it is. He is preparing you. Hallelujah. And when I speak about silence, I don't mean that God is not speaking or, or showing you what he wants you to do in the future are showing you that he is preparing you or he's preparing things around you but when I speak of silence I mean that you're not seeing the manifested work of God through what you're praying for um, God sometimes need to prepare us but he is speaking child of God he wants you to know that he is speaking and so if I go a few years back with my life I remember just praying and seeking the Lord. I wanted to know my purpose so badly. Everything I was doing, I was not contented. Every job I was in, I did not like or I would like it in the beginning. And then I would lose interest totally. And so I knew that I was not in my purpose. And I was asking God, but what is my purpose? What is, what is my purpose? And so God was showing me all along. It's only now that I understand the interpretation of dreams. I know now that then God was speaking to me. And so um, all along, God was preparing me for my purpose. I would sit and watch sermons after sermons after sermons. Um, he was teaching me and grooming me in my gifts. And so in that time, God would give me dreams of me being on stage. Um, I was preparing for something, but then all of a sudden I had no talent. And so God was showing me that I he needed to um, perfect my gift because the gift is always there, but he needed to perfect it. And so I would dream that I would be in these pageants and I would be ready to go on stage, but I had no talent for the talent section. I had my gown, um, but I had no talent or I had my talent prepared, but then I had no gown, like something was missing. My shoes were missing. Something was missing. And so all along and guys, these dreams would be so repetitive. Um, I would be wondering, but what is this? What is this? 
one time and this was years ago I had a friend and she came to me and she said to me I think you better join the dancing ministry I saw you on stage singing and dancing and the performance was so good but she did not even understand the meaning of the dream and it stood out to me what she said to me only now I am able to interpret the dream um, knowing that God would be calling me on a platform um, to speak publicly. Now I know this because I now understand the language of God. And so guys, for many of you, I know, I know, I know that God is speaking. You just have to pay attention to your dream and ask the Lord to help you to understand it. If you are praying and you're asking the Lord something, he's giving you the answer in your dreams. I'm telling you from my experience, all I have to do is tonight before I go to bed, ask God a question and boom, he will give me a dream or he will, well, I hear the voice of God now. So he speaks, but for many of you, God is speaking consistently in your dreams. Any dream that is repetitive, God is speaking and he wants your attention. You're praying about it often. He is speaking. God will not turn his back on you, but he wants you to get what he is saying. Um, many of you may say, why does God speak in parables? Can't he just come out and just tell me? But this is the way God speaks. He wants you to grow spiritually, to understand his language. And so that's it guys his ways are not our ways our thoughts are not his thoughts and so i can't tell you the reason why um god likes to speak to us in parables god likes to speak to us in dreams symbols i do not know but this is the way god speaks for me i'm in the prophetic so he speaks to me directly and he speaks to me with clarity and sometimes guys god will give me a word and i have to be sitting thinking um okay he gave me this word i have to still put it together i have to look for scripture i have to put it together for it to make sense so that's how god <laughs> operates um so guys that is it i don't know who this word is for but god is saying that he is preparing you for your purpose child of god rest assured that god wants you to be in your purpose more than you do i'm telling you i'm telling you he will get you there continue to seek his face continue to do what you're doing you're on the right path god will get you there so guys that is it i don't know who this is for but receive it. Thank you guys for tuning in. I love you guys so much. Stay blessed. Stay tuned. And until my next one, bye.